हेलो गाइस दिस इज योगेश गुप्ता एंड वेलकम टू माय ट्यूटोरियल्स एंड इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी शोइंग यू हाउ टू एनेबल हाइपर वी इन विंडोज 8.1 पॉइंट वन एज वेल एज हाउ टू क्रिएट वर्चुअल मशीन यूजिंग हाइपर वी सो बाई डिफॉल्ट विंडोज एट पॉइंट वन कंटेंट्स हाइपर वी सॉफ्टवेयर हाउ एवर इट इज इंट एनेबल्ड बाई डिफॉल्ट सो वन हैज टू एनेबल इट बिफोर यूसेज सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई शो यू हाउ टू एनेबल इट गो टू योर कंट्रोल पैनल लाइक आई डू Now, once you are in the control panel, click on uninstall a program. Now, here you will see a link saying "Turn Windows Features On or Off," and here we can see that Hyper-V option. By default, it won't be checked, and we'll have to check it. So, once it's checked, it will require a reboot, and post that it will enable all the services of Hyper-V. So, once done, click on OK. and it will automatically configure and enable the services for hyper v as well as it will reboot so i have already carried this process uh, since it takes a long time so once done i'll go to my start here i'll type hyper v and i'll go to hyper v manager now here i can see there are multiple option and this is my local host that is uh, this host name I here on the right I can see a new option I'll click on there and I'll click on creating a new virtual machine now we'll give it a name for example I'll just give it a name like linux test and I'll click on next now here I'll uh, let it be default just for the sake of this tutorial I won't get into much complex process so i'll click on next now depending on the operating system which we are using we'll need to specify the amount of ram it will be requiring so for this i'll just uh, uh, allow 1 gig of ram for this process and i'll also check this use dynamic memory for this virtual machine and i'll click on next and once again i'll click on next now it will ask me the amount of size i would like to allocate for this hard drive that is this virtual hard disk and by default i'll uh, let it be as 127 gigabyte and i'll click on next now it will ask me for the boot media so i'll click on the second option saying install an operating system from bootable cd dvd rom here i'll select the iso image like for this test i'll be using uh, red hat image so i'll specify the part to my red hat uh, iso i click on that and i'll click on next now once configured it will give you an acknowledgement of whatever configurations you have selected during this wizard now once you are done with that click on finish and we can see that it's creating a virtual environment for the linux now here we'll click on connect first of all to see the screen and here we can see the power button just click on start and we can see that the linux installation has started so i'll just install it and i'll install the operating system
since it will take some time i'll pause the video for time being so guys we have seen that we have installed uh, linux on this hyper-v's virtual machine so that's all for my tutorials and in the, any case if you have uh, queries or comments please feel free to post it in the comment section below and i'll be glad to help you that's all for my tutorial guys thank you